her attorneys didn't say much, and Baltimore City State's attorney Marilyn Mosby said nothing at all as the defendant and her legal team made their way inside U.S. District Court Wednesday afternoon for the first of two hearings to resolve outstanding legal issues before Mosby's criminal trial later this month on federal charges of perjury and lying on loan applications. Today, the judge heard two sets of motions and issued oral rulings from the bench. The judge granted or granted in part both of the government's motions. The judge narrowed the topics and issues defense experts can testify to at trial, and she barred the defense from claiming Marilyn Mosby is the target of vindictive prosecution. And in a victory for the defense, the jury at the trial will not hear about prior investigations of the defendant. The jury will, however, hear from two government witnesses about forensic accounting and tax code, and they will hear terms like financial hardship and hardship withdrawal. Marilyn Mosby, her husband, the city council president, and her attorneys also declined to talk to us or any other reporter on their way out of court today. We learned at the end of this hearing that Mosby has yet to be arraigned on the superseding indictment, basically the updated indictment. The judge said that will happen at the next hearing set for next Wednesday afternoon. Jury selection, the judge said, begins the following day. It'll go into that Friday if need be. And Marilyn Mosby's criminal trial begins on September 19th here at federal court. Reporting live tonight, I'm Kate Amara, WBAL TV 11 News.